Afternoon, YouTube. It is Friday afternoon, home from Freight Day, and surprise, because the past couple of times I've come home from Freight Day, I've been uh, smoking a cigar. Well, money's getting a little bit tight, and cigars ain't cheap, so it's a pipe. And I think I said in my last video, that's what I was going to try to do, is, uh, is smoke, a, uh, is, uh, smoke a pipe so I could do a review on... That's exactly what I'm doing. Do a review on this Sam Gawith Wintertime Flake, which is an English blend. Very good English blend, I might add. Which I'm smoking in my Calabresi. You can see it in a not dark video. <laughs> yeah, wintertime shot of the property. Yeah, we got hit pretty heavy by that last snowfall, as I'm sure a lot of people have. Pat, if you're watching this, <laughs> I'm sure you, your neck of the woods looks about the same. And that's pretty much about what I've done at work the past couple of days is just digging the store out, really. So... Sorry, I know it's kind of shaky. I'm doing with my phone. So the Sam Gawith Wintertime Flake. Which, as the name suggests, is the winter... Uh, is the winter um, season flake. The uh, season tobacco that they have. They, uh, Sam Gawith has got a seasonal uh, tobacco. One for the winter, spring, and uh, the summer and the autumn. And uh, so, it's winter. Figure I'd get a hold of some of the winter flake before... Uh, before winter was over. And um, I like it. Like I said, it's an English blend. It's actually the only English blend in the seasonal uh, tobaccos. And it's it's nice and robust. Nice and earthy. Real robust. Not quite as robust as the Cerberus or, or a three-headed bitch, if you will. Um, but that's okay. Because, uh, to be honest, although, uh, you know... Although the three-headed bitch has grown on me, I, I, I do have to say Cerberus is a bit more... I'm, I'm sorry I'm squinting. It's really bright out. Um, actually, I got some shades. Hey, I got shades. Give me a second. Ah, that's better. <laughs> Personally, like I said, although the, uh, the Cerberus uh, has grown on me, it, it, it is... Uh, at times, if not the majority of the time, uh, obnoxiously robust, um, more robust than is necessary. And I think a large part of that, well, part of it is, you know, it, it's got basically almost every type of tobacco in it. And, uh, I think, you, you know, a little extra on the dark fired, on the dark fired Kentucky kind of put a little more build on it than it needed. But the wintertime flake is very good. It's a nice English, nice smooth English. It's robust and it's earthy like you would expect from an English um, but it's still, it's still pleasing to the palate, you know. It's got a good taste. Got the hat on that I wore in my, uh, last two videos. Uh, last one I was, uh, smoking the, the full Virginia. And the one before that was my, uh, spaghetti western uh, video response to uh, Shadrach's competition. Um, I was having way too much fun last night. If you haven't, if you haven't seen it yet, give it, give it a look. Um, it's the only video that I have that's not in color. <laughs> so check it out. Well, I think I'm going to go inside and uh, finish up this bowl. Um, it's posted on Instagram. Was just finishing up that uh, the last half of the bowl of the uh, full Virginia flake in my Dublin pipe. Oh, that is good stuff. Both the full Virginia flake and the wintertime flake were real good buys. So um, I think I'm gonna finish up this flake, um, pour myself some tea, and relax. I'm at the end of a nine-day stretch at work. Which, you know, it's a, it's a 40-hour work week, but when you got an inconsistent schedule, 
and it carries over, you know, past seven days to nine days, you know, it starts wearing on you a little bit. But this is actually the start of my four-day weekend. So maybe I'll just make a bunch of videos. <laughs> no, I'm going to kick back. Kick back, go inside, kick back, smoke down the rest of this pipe. Although I did hear, um, if you live in the northern part of the country, um, supposedly we're supposed to get like six or seven more inches by Sunday. I don't know if that's in Michigan or Pat, if you're watching this, I don't know if that's out in Jersey. Um, but in any case, if you live in Michigan, um, you live in Michigan, you live in the north where you're going to start getting some snow, uh, you know, you definitely, oh, you know what, why not? Since I'm wearing the hat. <clears throat> If you're getting some snow, drive safely. Take her easy, YouTube.